mentioning to uh, Len. Here's, a, uh, well, Len Valletta here to talk a bit more about what this means, these uh, hike in interest rates for the money in your wallet. And he's from the Albany Financial Group. Len, thank you so much for being with us. Hey, Julie. Uh, okay, so I guess plain and simple, what does this mean for, you know, the everyday person and the money that sure, they have? Sure, I would say to you right now, not a lot. A quarter percent is not a big hike. But if you have a variable interest rate, so credit cards, as you mentioned, uh, it could be a home equity line or any type of consumer loan that has a variable rate, you'll, li you'll likely see a small increase on a monthly basis. There's projected to be more coming in 2017. We'll see if that pans out. But I guess I would say if somebody's got a lot outstanding on a variable rate loan, then try to pay it down as best you can. Okay, so I guess in the whole grand scheme of things, who are the people that are going to be impacted by this the most, even though you say it's not that much? Sure, uh, and, and as I say, if, if someone has, they're maxed out on their credit cards or they're in a situation where they've got a home equity line and they've, they've built that up, then they are in fact going to see an increase in the interest component, component of that on a monthly basis. So as I say, those will be, will be impacted, but not a whole lot just yet. Okay, and long term, what should people be doing now if... In fact, it does come to fruition that they do end up hiking the interest rates two more times in the coming year. Sure, sure. And I already alluded to it, right? So if you can, try to pay down those loans or possibly consider locking in something. So if someone's got an adjustable rate mortgage, I might talk to your, your banker about the possibility of locking that in because the fixed rates have gone up in, since the election, but they're still not too high. They're still at historic low rates, so I might consider locking in those rates. Okay. Len, thank you so much for being with us okay, this Jay. afternoon.